Happy Friday, everyone. Welcome to episode six of Ask Dave. Dave, everyone's seeing an increase in phishing emails over the past few months. In fact, just this week, even our own company was targeted unsuccessfully, I might add. When cruising my inbox, what are the first indications I should look for if an email looks like it could be a phishing scam? Great question. Probably one of the best ones yet. Uh, it is very easy as you're cruising through your inbox and emails are coming in to get tripped up by an email from someone you typically expect. Social engineering and a phishing scam is going to allow a perpetrator to say, for example, send an email from me to you asking you for a request. First thing you look at on any email, and this is just a rule number one is, does the name match the email? Many times on a phishing attack, it might be from Dave Bailey, but the email address doesn't, isn't from Dave Bailey. So that's number one. Number two, uh, many times the frame of the email or any objects in there um, will, will not look right. Something won't necessarily look right. And usually you can pick that up. If you're spending a lot of time in your email, you'll see that. And number three, what's the context of the email? Is it a request that I would have made or a request that that person would have made uh, from you? Would I ask you for your personal email outside of work? Or would I ask you to call me on my cell phone, have an urgent issue? Would I ask you to send me money? I mean, the request is usually the third pretty alarming um, context that says, hey, this is not a good message. Always, always be on the lookout for that. And anytime it's a suspect email, don't click on it, delete it. If it's important enough, someone will send it to you again. Always delete it and let, let your uh, IT professional in your organization know that, hey, I think someone's trying to do something. Got it. So no, don't forward it, but delete it. Definitely don't forward it. That would be bad. That'd be bad. Okay, Dave. Well, thanks again, everyone. That's a wrap for episode six, and we'll see you next week. Adios. Ah, Got a technology question you need an answer for? Send us an email at connect.articit.com and your question might be featured on the next edition of Ask Dave.